most welcome to Katakui so and to Teso. We are very privileged to host you. I appreciate very sincerely from the bottom of my heart the acceptance of the most reverend Dr. Stephen Kazimba Mgalu to come here at home to pay a courtesy visit to us. I sincerely appreciate Bearing in mind that you have come to serve all the people of Teso sub-region, which has 10 districts, 10 to 12, 12 districts. If you are the Butebo and Palisa, sometimes even Tororo says we are also part of you. So it is a very big honor and privilege for us as a family to get this chance to interact with you right here at home. Indeed, it is by the grace of God that this kind of moment can be occasion. So we want to return all the glory to God. So I would like also to thank you for the role you are playing in the Interreligious Council of Uganda as the current chair now. You have demonstrated a clear picture that working together as humanity, as human beings, is a priority and it is an agenda that should be pursued by all of us as a country. So on behalf of government, allow me to extend our sincere gratitude to you for that very important role that you are playing symbiotically together with the government to transform the lives of our people. I thank you very sincerely. Jesus, the Son, and give him that glory, great things he has done. My visit here, it has been well, well prepared. The teacher, the, the captain, organizing team, your, your, Security team has done a great work. Everywhere, we have not had any problem bringing the boy child, who is totally left behind. Uh, even this time, graduation, mm -hmm. the girls about to five, six, mm -hmm. the first five, yes, the, the best, all girls, and the numbers, mm -hmm. all girls, which is good. But now, who's going to take these girls? The disorganized boys. Morning, <laughs> <laughs> they begin drinking from morning. That's not good. And uh, so that's the campaign I am really uh, carrying forward. And I want your support, Your Excellency. You Boy it. child. In order to in order to have our girl child protected. And to have uh, a peaceful family set up. Uh, the prayer of giving thanks. I think this is a, a very appropriate prayer. Who am I? I can't imagine how many people are in the parliament and, and I am choosing Major Retired Man, Jessica, you are the Vice President. Can you imagine? <laughs> There are many people, others can even try to somehow and they, they present themselves to be seen at least, uh, not you. Uh -uh. God will always pick his people of his choice. God has a tendency of picking a nobody to become somebody in front of everybody without consulting anybody. That is God. And he chose you. And he said, ah, ah, I, 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 I am calling, I, I want it. my daughter, Honorable Jessica, that's the one for this period of time. She's the one I, I want to be, the vice president. Mm -hmm. Members, God, God always chooses whoever he chooses to choose. God always picks whoever he chooses to pick. God always elevates whoever he chooses to elevate. It is his prerogative. 
No discussion, period. <laughs> and you said, yes, I will. So would you like to protect her? Protect your family. Protect the office she is uh, That's called it through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen and amen.